Loading accurate rifle ammunition takes time and patience. But more than that, it also takes the use of precision equipment. In this particular video, we're going to get an overview of the Redding 2400 case trimmer and see how its features, construction, and use can aid us in the loading of precision rifle ammunition. So let's take a, a look at an overview of the construction and features of the Redding 2400 case trimming lathe. First off, the body of this case trimming lathe is made of cast iron construction. That means that this case trimming lathe will withstand the test of time, it's very rigid, and produces consistent accurate results. The headstock portion of this case trimming lathe uh, features a, a universal step collet insert, which means that you don't have to buy individual collets or shell holders uh, for the different calibers that you'll be trimming brass for. This pin up at the top locks the shaft so that you can either release or grip the brass. It makes for very quick use. You let go of the pin and you can then uh, turn the shaft so that uh, the brass trimming commences. We've also got a small and large uh, primer pocket cleaning tool which makes for very easy and convenient primer pocket cleaning regardless of whether you're cleaning uh, something like 357 Magnum with a small primer or 223 we can just twist the brass with one hand and not have to hold the tool, it's very convenient or something larger like 30-06 where we'll be using the, the large primer pocket uh, cleaning tool once you get an assembly line uh, setup going this is very very quick in the center of this tool there's a convenient storage area for the, the pilots for loading different calibers. You can just take these out, insert them into the tool, drop them back into the holes where they're stored neatly out of the way. On the tailstock portion of this case trimming lathe, we've got a few nice features. Starting from the right hand side, we've got the, the cutting tool, which is, is a very tough uh, titanium nitride coated uh, cutter that lasts uh, quite a while and the pilot inserts into that uh, particular cutter uh, on this right hand end of the of the case trimming lathe and then we've got the micrometer uh, adjustment dial which is really a great feature and and this particular case trimming lathe comes pre-calibrated for 223 so the actual reading here is the actual length of the brass we've got this locking screw here so so normally we cannot uh, turn the dial so that our, our setting is preserved, but if we loosen this lock nut, we can then uh, turn the tool here. And we can see here the Allen screw uh, that retains the, the pilot uh, so that we can quickly change that tool by using an Allen screw. Once we set the lock nut, it holds that firmly in place. We've also got our um, case neck cleaning brush attachment here where we can screw a, a brush into uh, the press here in this tapped hole and then that allows us to clean uh, the necks of brass rather easily. So we can clean primer pockets on one side and we can clean uh, the necks of the brass on the other side. The case uh, trimming lathe also comes with this smaller brush for smaller uh, case neck diameters like you'd find with 223 brass and that kind of thing. The Redding 2400 case trimming lathe is a well-built precision piece of equipment that's a pleasure to use. Investing in equipment like this uh, is a smart move as it will last a lifetime and produce repeatable results year after year.